Hey world, I'm Josh. And I'm Lauren. Welcome to another episode of Let's Try Stuff. Booze edition. Tonight we are trying again from Route 23, this time the Pear Rosemary Simple Syrup. Per the suggestion of their website, we are trying it with vodka. They also suggested gin or Prosecco, I think. Uh, it is one ounce of this to two ounces of vodka. We're using Crystal Head Vodka. Route23.com. This is uh, from Columbus, Ohio. And water, organic, cane sugar, pear juice, concentrate, rosemary, and citric acid. The smell is very rich rosemary. Almost uh, too much. And they do suggest on the back of the box um, possibly uh, topping it off with uh, soda or a few other things. I can't remember. Might not be a terrible idea, but we don't have any, so we're going straight up like this. What do you think? It's good. It's too sweet. It's very pear and very rosemary, so I feel like you get both of the flavors. It's a little syrupy as this ratio. Um, I would definitely cut it with club soda. Yeah, that's tough. Um, maybe I'd have a different opinion in the winter. Um, maybe it would pair better with some other stuff. I felt like when we couldn't figure out what to pair it with because it wasn't on the recipes part of the website, we thought, I was thinking maybe whiskey instead. And now I'm thinking that even more. Mm -hmm. Maybe. I think that would be a better match. I mean, mm -hmm. it's good with vodka. It's just, I swear I used two ounces of the syrup and four of the vodka to make our drinks. Right. No, I... But it feels like, again, like with the pepper one, we could cut the syrup in half. They uh, suggest these syrups for baking as well. Mm. And I think this might be better suited for cooking applications than drinking. Yeah. Except maybe as a small dash, like a capful, to mm -hmm. like add a little accent of a flavor. Like, I've had drinks where they've put rosemary sprigs in them. Rather than that, perhaps a splash of this. But just straight up this and vodka. Ugh. Their flavors are bold, and it's tough to drink. Mm -hmm. It's really... I like the flavors. I really like how strong the rosemary is. Because I've had rosemary in simple syrup before, and it's, it's never been this strong. It's accurate. It's potent. It's uh, natural tasting. I could just use an ounce or two of club soda to just thin it out a little bit. Yeah. Um... I, some something some kind of savory note wouldn't hurt either, or some bitters or something. Mm -hmm. There's something to work with here, and the answer isn't just vodka in this. Yeah, I think these are good tools for somebody who is a home bartender and really likes to experiment with flavors. Yeah, I guess if we were to ignore the taste of this particular drink and just comment on the syrup uh, itself, I think... It's very interesting, very strong, mm -hmm. um, so it has some potential, potentially useful or potentially interesting applications. I just would need more of it to experiment and figure it out. Mm -hmm. I, th I think that it would go really well with like a bullet. Mm-hmm. Even a full-on rye. Yeah. But. Not just vodka, not without thinning it out somehow. Yeah, it's really great flavor. It's just a lot. Heavier on the rosemary than the pear. Yeah, I think so too. So, I don't know if this was a review or what this was at this point, because it's kind of all over the place because it's something strange, and we didn't get to the bottom of what this should be used like how this should be used. I think we did. We talked about using it in cooking and... I mean, we personally didn't actually find it. Uh, we, we didn't have enough to experiment and present an answer. Yeah. 
So, if you've tried this and or you have it and you experiment because nothing goes away on the internet, leave a comment and if you eventually figure it out, let us know what you came up with and maybe uh, we'll shoot another video trying out your idea. Anything else? No, it's quite good. It just needs some some work in a cocktail context. Yeah, I think some bartenders, some mixologists uh, could have some fun with this. Yeah. So, thanks for watching. Tell us what to try next. Leave a comment down below and subscribe. Bye.